Can you tell me some of those, man? But it gets to that point of like, you know what I'm saying? You get the Sharons, you get the DNAs, you get the yourselves, mm -hmm. the people like even disasters in them who can really get in there and just yep. mid rounds, just jump somewhere and and it kind of like don't get the respect though. It's like if you do a dope freestyle. Uh, you know what I mean? People people don't understand how difficult that is, basically, right. is what I say. I feel right. like when you see somebody freestyling in the battle, that's like way, extra points. You 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 are a freestyler. Most at definitely. This point yes, sir. Appreciate it. No, definitely. I definitely. And I agree. And I feel like even the times when I freestyle, I don't even get the credit for it as somebody who would, you'll be like, damn, man, when you jump into those bags, by me doing it now, I understand it. Like, damn, that's not an easy thing to do to be able to jump into really? a freestyle bag, go back to your riddance, maybe mm -hmm. jump into a freestyle bag again because you're trying to get the crowd. Because sometimes a lot of freestylers, they jump into that because they maybe the material didn't hit or something didn't land right. So, okay, let me let me jump right here real quick. Or maybe they lost train of thought, so they had to go like right. it stops you from choking. But it's difficult, you know what I mean? Right. Everybody, you see people, as many people as you see choke, if they knew how to freestyle, they would they would just rap. They would say something different and keep going, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, kind like how do you feel like as far as the freestylers? Is it like the lost art in the culture yeah. right now? I think it's a complicated question that's super nuanced because – in some ways, I feel like it's more respected right now than it was. Than it used to be, because okay. Of, because of people really starting to rebuttal, like people the rebuttals like for sure. A Ward and Chef Trez. Chef Trez. Like Chef Trez really brought it to the URL side Facts. of things where it mm -hmm. became cool. Yeah, it's a rebuttal. Because rebuttaling has always been big in like Grind Time, mm -hmm. King of the Dot. Like, mm -hmm. who's got the dopest flips, yeah, bro? Yeah, like, England, yeah. too. England, they love that shit. Mm -hmm. But. Yeah, rebutting. I don't think it was so big on URL yeah, to like, Trez kind of yeah, coined that. Yeah, because DVD oh, never was about freestyles. It was about yeah. bringing the hottest bars, yep. mixtape bars, yeah. general mm -hmm. bars you had. And it was kind of like these right. two forms of battle rap. One starting from Scribble, one starting from Smack DVD were evolving at the same, same time. time. But now, you know, now it's all mixed yeah, up. Yeah, so to see that. people on URL and RBE, like Chef Trez and... And, and then you know people like Gucci and Dan, like Danny Myers was never a freestyler. Yeah. Now he's insane, insane at freestyling. That's a fact. One of the best. So it's like becoming an attribute you have to learn, which I do appreciate. But I also agree with you. It's a lost art in the sense of like people don't understand it. Like people mm -hmm. don't like you see people all the time look, looking at those hot 97 freestyle yeah. thing, like this was a crazy freestyle, freestyle. Like, they're, yeah, they're yeah. talking about the new york definition yeah, of freestyle, they, they, yeah that's their definition which is like free verse, free verse. you know yeah. but people mm -hmm. don't understand the difference and people don't understand the art form and the difficulty of it so it gets slept on for sure um and it's definitely something that like you know when i do those like little white boy freestyles like whenever i play a show yeah. i start with that to to, that's my little gesture trying to keep yeah. the art form alive yeah. and be spontaneous and in the moment you know icebreaker for sure get people kind of in tune because yeah you definitely showing them because it's like okay there's no way he could have wrote this because we just gave him a word right. that only i knew and uh -huh. you know what i mean and, and being a like white that. boy like who's you know I, I i often open for bigger artists who came through the bay when i was younger too so like Fire. having to like like i think the first one I ever did was like travis scott this was mm. before he was super big like this is like pretty early on but yeah. i opened for him and the crowd was just not having it and yeah. then i did my freestyle and the crowd was like then after yeah. i did that they tuned in and i was like this is a good way to like show people who are like very skeptical is like yeah. you know i'm some this i've like dedicated time to this craft the bay is slept on for their freestyle abilities as well though like you got cats like mr fab out there who just he's always been able to go, freestyle go, and just go. you know what i mean just get up there and and i seen them on just recently with like the back of the class freestyle and mm. doing the little thing where they, they beat, beat on the desk yeah. and i'm just like yo still this late in his career in the game he's still off the top you know, and a lot of people, that's what we said the difference, the free verse and off the top. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. just off your dome. Like, that's the West Coast freestyle, like, where we, just, you know, we said, like, what you was doing, though, as well. Yeah, like, you yeah. know what I mean? It was, it was garbage, like, but it was, you did it. You know what I'm messing with? Like, I don't know where. <laughs> you know? It but, like, nah, but it's the it West like, Coast thing, man. Just, you know what you know, I'm saying? Where we take what's around us, we talk about it to let you know, like, mm -hmm. this is right here in the moment. We ain't, this ain't later on. You know what I'm saying? This is what's going on right now. Why do you think that is that it's so coastal like that? You think we're just kind of smarter? out here or something i mean it could be I mean, that's just the it way could be that no like, but think uh, about how important like radio and stuff like that is out in new york where it's like you got to come up to the studio and you have to like yeah sit with us this is our guy right here to get on hot you know to get on hot 97 is like a fucking pinnacle achievement if you're an up-and-coming rapper so that style it probably fits them a lot better based on like career trajectories and the format. No, Maybe it's yeah. a little bit different out here. Yeah. I'm surprised that it's not as big out there, given that, like you were saying, Smack DVDs are like, give me your hottest bars right here. But 
for them, it's not let me come up with something on the spot. Mm. It's yeah. I'm going to tell you the same thing that I told, you know, 114th <laughs> Street, 115th Street, uh -huh. 116th Street. Right. So, like, that's, I don't know, it's just different. I think it came from a place of, like, them being, like, of course, the birthplace of hip-hop. You got to give them their respect to that. Right. So, you got to think, Raising if we on that. the West and we hearing the word freestyle, that's probably what we was automatically, mm -hmm. def you know what I mean, thinking. Like, okay, they, they coming off the top. <laughs> right. They freestyling. Mm -hmm. So, we naturally probably it just. It was a mistake. Yeah, it was a mistake. <laughs> like, <laughs> okay, we just freestyling real quick, you know what I'm saying? Freestyle king,